Hi, and welcome to Interactive Tutorial. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a lead form. Lead form helps you to collect emails and other information of potential customers. You can embed a lead form on your website as a standalone block or show it to users after completing a game or quiz. First of all, sign into your profile on interactive.me to start. To create a lead form, click the Template Gallery button at the top of the screen. Select Lead Form. Select the template you like from the list by clicking the Edit. The Preview button will allow you to preview the template. I'm going to use Simple Lead Form template as an example. You will see form fields that you can use for your lead form. First of all, I want to add a picture above. Click on plus icon to create a new block and select image. There are two ways to upload a new image, directly from your computer or using the Unsplash library. My library section is images you previously used in other projects. They can be uploaded from Unsplash or from your computer. Unsplash library is direct access to the Unsplash stock photo service. Upload media button allows you to add an image from your computer. I prepared a picture for my project in advance, so I'm gonna use this option. I click Upload media, select the picture and click Open. After the file upload, I click Place Image. Perfect. Now let's click Edit to modify our form fields. To add a new field, just check the box you need. By adding new fields, you will see changes on the right side of your screen. You can evaluate how your future project will look like in this preview. I'm gonna keep first name, last name, and email fields and remove company name field. Click add field button if you want to add an extra field to your lead. I want to get a feedback from my customers for example, so I choose text area in the field type menu and our field name is gonna be feedback. Users will write their thoughts in this field. Let's scroll down to fill with additional information. It contains header and description. This is what your customers will see first. I fill header with give us your thought and description with your feedback will help us to get better. Don't forget to rate the final result on the preview screen. We can also change the button text and give a link to your privacy policy if needed. Now let's move to the Thank You tab. This screen will appear when the user will finish to fill your lead. Choose the header sign and add a description if needed. I'm gonna keep this sign and fill description with We will use this information to improve our services. You can also add a background image by clicking Upload button. I will use Upload Media option again, since I keep pictures for this project on my computer. Choose a picture. Click Place Image. And we are done. Click on Save button. Now you can click the preview and evaluate the current state of your project. Try your lead form and don't forget to rate how it looks on different devices. To do this, switch between the phone and personal computer icons. If you notice an error or decided to fix anything, return to the editor by selecting this menu item. Don't forget to select a title for your project. 
This will make it easier to find it. Let's name our project as Lead Form. After that, you can safely click the Publish button. Your project is ready. You can share it with your audience by sending a link or choosing any other convenient way. Let's view our project. As you can see, our project works perfect. Keep in mind that you can always return to editing your template again by clicking the Edit button in my Projects tab. You can also check statistics by clicking this button. So now, let's learn how to export leads. To export your lead, click on Statistics button next to your project. Find Lead Form on the left panel and click on it. Here you can find all information from your audience. Click Export button to save this file to your computer. It looks like this. You can also set email notifications to your Lead Form. You will get an email for new form responses in this case. To do this on your published project, click on Edit button next to your project. Go to Integrations tab. Turn on Email Notifications and enter your email. After that, click Save. To save your changes, click on Publish button. It's done. From now on, when you got a new information to your lead, you will see a new message in your inbox.